Welcome to e-commerce store in PHP and MySQLi with Bootstrap and in previous video I have stylized this front and top strip of this thing e-commerce store thing so I go back to my notepad plus plus this is the style.css page has been open but I am not to work on it in this video so I go to my index.php page and I shall begin my work in this page from this video so I come out of the closing div of top ends where the top ends I would like to show you that this is the closing div of top ends so I am going to start my work right under it I make one more div div start and div close and I assign a class to it neighbor space neighbor dash default So friend this project is very lengthy so I shall make all this project step by step and slowly and steadily. ID is equal to navbar I have assigned one ID to it on the name of navbar and now I comment it navbar space navbar dash default starts. I copy this comment and paste it at the closing div here I inside this neighbor ID div I have made one more div and I assign a class to it class is equal to double cards container now I comment it container starts and container ends I copy this comment and paste it at the closing div here I write ends inside this container div I make one more div div start and div close and I assign a class to it neighbor dash header neighbor dash header starts and neighbor dash header ends and now under this div and inside this div not under it I make one anchor tag anchor start and anchor close inside this neighbor dash header div I have made this anchor tag and I am assigning a class to it navbar dash brand space home to this anchor tag now harof is equal to double cards index.php the first page address to this home class neighbor dash brand space home so now I comment it neighbor space neighbor dash brand starts
is the home. Now we copy it and paste it at the closing anchor tag. And here I write ends. Now I make one ing tag inside this anchor tag as the single tag img space src is equal to double cards images the folder main folder backslash logo dot png it is the png image which I have already put in this images folder so I go inside the, my computer and I go inside the images folder so these two logo images and direct extension is png you can watch here png and it is also png image this logo is for smaller screen and this logo is for the desktop computer computer screen so i have included this image first which is inside the images folder i show you This is the images folder. So I go back to my Notepad++ code editor. Alt is equal to double cards. Here I write computer fever space logo. And I assign a class to it. This class is hidden dash access. I mean, this logo should be hidden when it is screen size should be changed to extra small size. Then this class will be worked. When the screen size will be transferred to extra small, then this logo will be hidden. One more IMG tag. As img space src is equal to double cast images backslash logo and this time which will be the smaller logo logo dash small dot png once again i use the alt tag is equal to computer fever space logo And I also assign a class to it. Class is equal to double cards. This logo should be visible when the screen size will be transferred to extra small. Control S to save. So now I go to my Chrome browser and I refresh this page. So friend, you can watch this computer fever logo. And if I make it smaller, then I don't know it will be visible I hidden or not because I have not yet stylized it in my style.css page, but I try. Yes, it has been hidden. Now you can see that that smaller logo is being shown over this page when the screen size has been decreased. So if I increase it in size, now you can see the bigger logo is being shown over here. But when I stylize this logo in my style.css page, style page, then it will be showing more clearly. So friend, this video I think has been made enough. So in next video, I shall come back and I shall begin my work again. Right above of this code, which is the two IMG code, IMG tags. So goodbye. I see you in next video.